Hi guys, so I know I look completely ridiculous with this uh, sticky tape on my face, but this is the look we're going for today. So it's a really cool kind of um, indie look. It's great for music festivals or going out in the town or something like that. Um, so it's it's a really um, big sort of cat eye and uh, with the blue inside, so it gives you a bit of pop of colour. And you can use any colour on, on this section over here. I just chose blue because uh, I thought it was cool. Um, so I've started off with, I've put um, just a piece of masking tape um, just on the outer corner of my eye and I've just followed the line, just continued on where my bottom eyelid is, just continued it up to where my um, eyebrow is. So that'll give us the really sharp sort of line that we're looking for. And then I'm going to use some eye primer. This is Napoleon. And it's important for this look because we're using quite bright colors. We don't want it to crease. Okay, so the next step is just grab yourself a, a fairly nude color and just a fluffy brush. And we're just going to apply that all over the lid, all the way to your brow. Okay, once you've got that color all over the lid, just grab yourself a lighter color. So I've got this pearly um, cream color, it's almost white. And we're going to put that just with the same brush right underneath the brow. And also in the inner corner of the eye. Okay, so the next step is the liquid eyeliner. So that's all for the um, eyeshadow. Okay, so I'm using this uh, L'Oreal Super Liner and it's really black, so I like it. Um, so we're going to do a really thin, thin line um, in the inner corner of the eye and bring it out to quite a big flick. And that's where the tape will assist you, give you that really sharp line. Okay, so the next step is to get yourself an angled brush, a clean one, and then I'm going to get this really electric blue. So it's just this one here, and I'm putting it just in the, in the inner half of that line that we just drew. Okay, so now the blue is in the um, inner half of that black line, and I'm just going to grab that uh, color that we highlighted our brow with, so the pearly color, and just put it on the lower lashes. So we don't want anything underneath the lashes because we want that blue to be the standout. Okay, so now it's time to take off the sticky tape moment of truth 
lovely. So a little bit has creeped out underneath the tape just close to the eye. That's easily fixed. So I haven't got any uh, foundation on this side of the face obviously. Um, I, w I used foundation on this side and also bronzer. Uh, so I'm just using this Revlon uh, Photo Ready Airbrush. I hadn't used it before today but I quite like it. So it just comes out like a little foam. I'll show you. So it looks like a lot, but it just like goes into nothing. Oh, and also before um, I applied my foundation, I used this Photo Ready um, Perfecting Primer by Revlon as well. I quite liked it. Um, it's a little bit thicker than other primers that I've tried, but it's not, um, it's not too bad. It's quite nice. So hopefully that'll keep the makeup on throughout your music festival or whatever you want to use this makeup on for. Um, and now I'm just going to put on some mascara on the top and bottom lashes. And I forgot to put concealer on under this eye. So just dot that on all the way along and just get any blemishes that you might have. And then I'm just going to put some half lashes just on the outer um, corner of the eye. So I've already done it on this one. Just gives you that bit of extra uh, flick, adds a bit of definition to that big cat eye. So I'm just using these ones, just um, fairly natural. Okay, so now while um, that the false lashes are drying, I'm just going to put some of this Revlon uh, lipstick on. It's a fairly nude colour. It's number 420 and it's called Blush. And then I'm just going to put some uh, bronzer. I'm not putting on any blush for this one because I think the, um, the blue eyes are enough. I don't want to make it too colourful. So the bronzer, I'm going to do it like a contour but bring it up slightly so that it goes a little bit on my cheeks as well. Okay, so that's the finished look. So I hope you have enjoyed that one. So it's a really cool uh, kind of different take on a cat eye. So I hope you like it. You can use any color you want uh, to match your outfit or whatever you have. And you should really try it. Cause it's really easy with the tape and everything. You don't need to have a very steady hand for it. So give this one a go and let me know what you think. Thanks, bye.